illegal, dangerous, out of control. Those are just some of the ways lawmakers are describing ride-sharing companies like Uber and Lyft. And they say they can change that with legislation. They're not regulated. To change that, several lawmakers have introduced multiple bills to regulate the companies that hook people who need a ride up with those offering one with a simple cell phone app. Senator Dale Zorn introduced a bill that requires Uber drivers have a chauffeur's license, like taxi drivers. So it puts them all on a level playing field. His bill, as well as another introduced by Senator Rick Jones, would also address insurance. They say the way Uber and other ride sharing companies are operating now, they don't have insurance required under the law to protect their customers. They've received a letter from the state saying, stop all operations, you're illegal. With a little bit of regulation, with proper insurance coverage, you know, they could be legal. Uber says it does most of the things this legislation would call for on its own. It provides insurance in its own way at the corporate level, providing $1 million in coverage to customers. It does background checks on drivers and is safe. It feels what it does is legal. Lawmakers, Democrat and Republican, say without laws, they aren't convinced rideshare services are as safe as traditional taxis. They do some sort of preliminary background checks on this, but it's not as quite regulated or safe as our taxi cab system is. State lawmakers say these bills simply help the laws keep up with technology and how they've changed how we get around. In Lansing, Kim Russell, The Now Detroit.